Well, today, one Northern Kentucky organization is launching a huge effort to help the victims of the tornadoes that hit the tri state earlier this month. Nine News reporter Shannon Kettler is live in Erlanger at St. Vincent de Paul with how you can make a difference. Good morning, Shannon. Good morning, Brian. I am here at the Erlanger location, as you mentioned, on Crescent Springs Road. For St. Vincent de Paul, they are going to be donating all sales here today and from their three other stores to their Tornado Relief Fund. And joining me now to tell us more about it is Ralph Bradburn, the Executive Director. Thanks for joining us here this morning. So tell us why you guys are doing this. Hi, Shannon. Pretty simple. You know, our mission here is to help folks that need help. And there are so many people in our community that have been impacted by these tornadoes that we have to be there to help them. And it's estimated that it's going to take 700 days for people to fully recover from these tornadoes. And we'll be one of the few organizations that are there for all 700. So we've got to get creative how we can make more funds available uh, to our tornado relief fund. So people can come here today do some shopping, and they can also drop off items as well. Tell me about that. Absolutely. Uh, any of our stores. We have four in Northern Kentucky. As you said, we're here in Erlanger, our main store, if you will. We also have a, don a, a, a store in Newport, Dayton, and Falmouth. All of those sales will go to the fund. All of those stores also act as our donation center, and that's the real key, uh, kind of getting the stuff in. I mean, that's what we really need. It's, it's amazing what people donate to us, so if you come out, I know you were looking earlier, so... Uh, <laughs> I'm always shopping. <laughs> yeah. What you were telling me, too, about the room we're in here, yeah. that this is normally a place you have a lot of furniture, but you've rearranged this because you're anticipating folks to buy more clothing than furniture today. Yeah, you know, furniture, not so much an impulse type buy. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, so we, we felt that most of the sales that we would have today would be clothing, housewares, things of that nature. So we converted our furniture room into our uh, clothes room west, so to speak. So uh, we've got a lot of stuff out here today. You do. Quite the selection. Well, Ralph, thank you very much for joining us this morning. And if you'd like to check out what St. Vincent de Paul has to offer, their stores open at 9 o'clock. Brian, I'll send it back to you. All right.